Hello everyone, welcome to the next session on Access Workbench Tutorials. In this session, we are going to analyze a torque range for static structural analysis. We have already discussed about the torque range and its application in the previous class. You can refer the video for the detailed understanding of a torque range. We will start by double clicking on static structural. I'll first go to engineering data, engineering data sources, general materials. Alloy steel is generally the material used for torque range. Since alloy steel is not available here, I'm using stainless steel as a material. I'll go to project and update project. Next, I'll go to geometry and right click. I already have the model of torque range made with me. So I'll directly input the file. Next, I'll go to model and double click on it. I'll go to geometry and I'll select all the parts. I will assign the material as stainless steel. Now once I'm done with that, I'll go to mesh and update mesh. Next, I'll go to static structure. On this face, I'm going to insert pick support. And on this surface, I'm going to insert pressure. I'll change to component along the x-axis I'll apply a pressure of 2 megapascal I'll go to solution and insert deformation total I'll insert deformation directional I want to see the deformation along the x-axis I will also insert strain stress equivalent next i'll solve
we'll first go to total deformation you can animate and check the result the total deformation is 6.8944 mm you can check the directional deformation the value is 6.88 mm along the x axis the value of elastic strain is 0 0.1517 and the equivalent stress generated is 21090 megapascal this is obviously a very large value so you can just change the value of pressure so that this value of stress can be reduced so with this i end the session i hope you have understood how to analyze a torque wrench for its stress deformation and strain if you have any doubts please write to me in the comment section don't forget to like share and subscribe to the channel hit the bell icon for latest video updates See you in the next session. Thank you.